on my scouting uh, expeditions uh, around the around London before I painted this particular series, I came across this location. It's uh, on the the estuary side of Tower Bridge, and it always appears to be the home for some um, sailing craft, uh, and it really gave gave a really good frame uh, for a painting. So the composition, I felt there was a really good composition in this particular location. I sort of, it, it was quite a difficult to find actually because it's hidden behind uh, sort of a lot of the, the actual access hidden behind a lot of buildings which front up onto, um, the, onto the Thames. And to the right hand side of it is it, St. Catherine's Dock, which, which all these modern buildings are, which surround one of the original docks of, of, uh, of London. It was a challenging painting. Uh, I was quite, actually quite happy with it in, in, in a sense is that I had basically about two hours to, to three hours to try and get the essence of the painting. What really caught me about, about this was that it had almost like three ages in it. It had the sailing boats to the front, it had the tower, tower bridge behind the Victorian bridge and it had the shard in the skyline behind, which is being built at the present moment in London, and it's going to be the highest building in in Europe. And also on on its on its left hand side, it had Butler's Wharf, which was a remnant of the sailing period of where the boats came in and and, and docked there. This is a very, very large polycarbonate and the wind was actually blowing down uh, river towards me. So I had to deal with not only the elements that were in the sky as the sun set, but also the physical elements of the wind and my material. I attacked this painting with a passion because I had no other method of doing it uh, in such a short period of time. Um, using large brushes and the reflective light um, it was really sort of, you know, if you're trying to catch the moment uh, with paint, it's quite difficult because you have a certain period of time you can actually do it in. Uh, so you've got to be very, very actively involved. This painting was is is, a, is called Sunset on the Thames, and it's an attempt to catch the atmosphere as it disappears with the setting sun down along the River Thames with Tower Bridge behind. I'm really happy with this painting. 